Hi guys, so in today's video, I'm going to just be trying to give myself dip nails again. I've actually done it once before, but tonight I just got the urge to pick them off. Uh, moral of the story is I need to redo them. So I'm gonna take you guys along with this journey. I didn't vlog the first time of me doing it because quite honestly, I didn't know exactly what I was doing. I was trying to figure it out, you know? So I think now I have a little bit more experience. I did my nails and then I did my mom's nails next time and those were pretty good. They were better than when I did it to myself. So I think I'm just gonna just have you guys join me on this experience I'm gonna be watching YouTube while I do this because it's a little bit of a process But like it's kind of fun a little bit satisfying and me and my sister's stockings We got a dip kit just off of Amazon. Do I know if it's like actually good? No Do I know how to do it perfectly? No, but am I getting better? Yes This is just coming from a everyday person not really knowing what they're doing so here is what we got. The first time my sister did my mom's nails, we did not have one of those little drills that you use at, or well, that they use at the salon. So we got one of those. And then these swatch sticks, which my sister actually painted them. I think I'm probably gonna do, I don't even know. I have to have a natural color for dance. It comes with all of these different things. It's like base, activator, top coat, and a brush saver. And then these colors. It's by the brand GH Dip. So I can try to see if I can find the kit and link it down below if you guys are interested. And then you can purchase all these different colors of dip. So we have some more coming. My mom ordered some more, but I have to have the natural for dance for now. So we can do fun colors later. Anyway, let's see which color I'm gonna do. Last time I just did this color, which was like a natural-ish color. I might do that one because they're pretty natural. But these are all the colors. First step though is I'm gonna soak these off because yikes. So I'm gonna take the drill and one of the file tips. It's just one of these. And then I have these things to wrap my fingers in. So that's a really long process that you probably don't wanna see. Here's my little update. So I took the file. Um, this tip and I kind of just filed like the top layer off of it and this is what I'll be using to soak it off I don't know if this works or not onyx professional soak off gel and all nail coatings maximum strength I don't know we're gonna try it out so I'm just gonna put it on a cotton ball and then put it on my nail and then wrap it and soak it so let's just do a time check it's 631 let's see how long this takes update 6:43 now so they've been soaking for almost 15 minutes now and that's what it says okay i didn't read the directions on here um basically you're supposed to put it in a bowl and then soak your nails for 15 minutes but i think that this will do like the same thing i feel like i hope so i'm just gonna open it up and see what it does hmm i love how it's not coming off i swear this is gonna take forever again this is the worst part about getting your nails done. We'll get a bit some more time. And I feel like I might need to like follow the directions. Hey guys. I, okay. One hand is done. They look horrible, but I cut them and like filed them or whatever. Yikes. That was not an easy process. So I think the next hand I'm going to soak them in a bowl because I don't feel like using the foil as a hassle if like it didn't even work that well. So I'll keep you updated. I've basically decided that I hate taking off nails. It's a horrible process. There's nothing fun about it. That's what I've decided. But I got them off and basically I just took the soak off stuff, put it in the bottom of a solo cup and just put it in there for like 15 minutes, try to take a cotton ball and like wipe it off. And Ugh, I hate that process. It literally makes me cringe, but I got them off and now the fact that I'm putting them back on scares me a little bit, but I'm hungry So I'm going upstairs, but it's now 722. Hi, I'm back in the same place with another update 
this is my update. Look at what they look like. Yeah, they're really thin and brittle. And I know putting dip on them again is not going to do any good. So I'm contemplating doing it. I've been contemplating doing it because I know I just need to give them a break. But in the same sense, they're prepped and ready to do dip. So let's just get to dipping. actually i need to use the little drill thing i put a different tip on it though and it's the one that kind of slants and i feel like that could be easier but as you can see when you first do it it's just bulky and gross especially this one i'm just going to go in and go with the drill and then after that you put on the top coat obviously but it's gonna take me a minute to do this <laughs> like just with the dip on them i feel like they're still natural but i am about to go wash my hands without soap and then add the top coat i've just been kind of perfecting them i changed the tip because the other one wasn't exactly enough power i guess but it was good for trying to get things accurate but I just got so sidetracked just trying to perfect them again. I still have my whole other hand to do, so I think I should just put the top coat on already. film any of this hand and I got it done faster and I actually think they look better and I did it with my right hand and I'm actually left-handed here they are all done they have potential could they be better at the nail salon and could I get tips at the nail salon yes but also no because I have to keep them natural for dance getting them done would be pointless because they would look about the same because I have to you know again can't get tips can't have a fun color so here's the bland color that I went with Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me on this journey. It is now 8.53 and we started at what, like 6.15? 6, no, 6.31. But um, I definitely took breaks and I went really slow also. But it's not like I could have gone anywhere anyway or done anything because there's a basketball game tonight but the roads are really, really, really bad where I am right now and I wasn't allowed to leave because like it, the roads are really bad. People are running off the roads and getting stuck in ditches and like i was driving all around today but then they finally got bad definitely good that um i just got it done now and there's nothing else to do lovely way to spend friday night if you ask me i'm probably just gonna lay in bed and read or watch youtube or tiktok even though i've been doing watching youtube uh the whole time i did my nails but anyway i love you guys so much definitely a random video it's definitely different but i hope you guys enjoyed thank you guys so much don't forget to comment like subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye